Thanks for joining us. I'm Chris McKinnon with the WBZ News Update. Our top stories today, grief counselors will be on hand at Stoughton High School today to help students cope with the loss of four classmates. Christopher Dezier, Eric Sarbla, Nick Joyce, and David Bell were killed Saturday when their car slammed into a tree in East Bridgewater. The driver, a 17-year-old, survived that crash and is being treated at a Boston hospital. Today, students are encouraged to wear the school's colors black and orange in support of the victims. The cause of the crash is still under investigation. A woman seriously injured after being hit by a car in West Bridgewater. Police say the 28-year-old was walking on West Center Street when she was hit just after 10 last night. She was flown to a Boston hospital with head and leg injuries. Our crew did see a damaged vehicle stopped at the scene. So far, no charges have been filed. A special meeting set for tonight to pick a new chancellor for U.S. Boston has been canceled. The Herald reports the president needs more time to go over feedback on the three finalists. Meantime, the faculty staff union is demanding the president and board of trustees reopen the search. They say they were shut out of the selection process and none of the candidates have shown they're qualified to lead the school. Now let's get a check of our forecast with meteorologist Danielle Niles. It's going to be a really nice day, Danielle. Chris, it's going to be awesome. The sun's going to be shining, humidity is going to be low, wind is going to be light, and we're going to warm up into the 70s to around 80 inland. Beautiful weather around 70 on the Cape today. Enjoy it. Tonight the clouds increase. We drop back into the 50s. Tomorrow will be cooler overall, but still right around average at the coast, 65 to 70, and still some 70s inland. We stay dry most of the day as well. Well, here's the hour by hour. What you will notice is a threat for a shower here inland during the mid to late afternoon, and there'll be a couple spotty showers around during the evening commute. Nothing all that substantial. There may be a few downpours south of the pike, especially, but that's not until late evening. Wednesday, the clouds decrease. We climb back into the 70s. Looks like a beautiful end to the week, warming back into the 80s on Friday, well into the 80s to kick off Memorial Day weekend. The weekend looks a little unsettled, Chris. There'll be some showers and storms around from time to time, so we'll pinpoint those down in the days to come. All right, Daniel, thank you very much. I'm Chris McKinnon. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day.